come on in. Of course, Lauren Phillips, adult time ambassador, is always here. Not not on time, but even early. Always early. So let's get you in. <laughs> Welcome everybody to another episode of We Like Girls. I am so excited to have Lauren Phillips on set today. Lauren is not only Adult Time's latest brand ambassador to join our roster, but she's also a fan favorite, especially with our lesbian porn fans. So it was a no brainer that we wanted to bring her on and be a part of We Like Girls. So Glenn is at your disposal today. He is here to give you whatever look you would like. And I do stand by that. So if you do want to go full goth and pipe, I, I can't choice. say no, but I will let that be your choice. <laughs> when Victoria arrives, which will be very soon, my one rule is that you are not allowed to see each other until the time that we bring so you hard. both together <laughs> live on camera, okay? So this is your sanctuary. Okay. You just can't leave it okay. without permission. All right, well, let's let, let's let Laura get settled and we'll come check on that wardrobe. <laughs> Hi, I'm Lauren Phillips and I am a Jersey girl, born and raised. And I've been, God, <laughs> in the adult industry for almost 10 years now. Why Victoria? Well, out of all of the women out there, <laughs> <laughs> that I could have chosen. I chose Victoria because me and her have a connection and we're actually really cro uh, close friends like in our personal life. So I feel like we've been wanting to really get that connection going and really show it on camera. And I thought this was being a great opportunity to really have both of us shine and kind of show the connection that we have. And I'm equally excited about who she chose for today's episode. You probably recognize uh, this woman as well because she's also a fan favorite. Her name is Victoria Vox. And I want to tell you about how I first heard about Victoria. Someone who I greatly admire and have worked with for many years, Casey Calvert, back in the day was a director with us and we were preparing a movie that she was going to make. Uh, and she said to me, I just have one get. There's one thing that I want to be a diva about if I can. And that is to request, absolutely insist, that we bring Victoria Vox onto the project because I have never seen anyone like Victoria. So that was how I learned about Victoria Vox. Funnily enough, even though she's worked for us many times, her and I have never worked directly. So when Lauren was like, I want Victoria Vox, it was like the worlds aligned and I became even more excited. Welcome to We Like Girls. Thank you, I do like girls. Good, there's a girl in that building that likes you quite a lot. Yes. And yes. as such, I'm gonna put the brakes okay. because my one rule for today is until you guys see each other, I'm not gonna let you see each other. So we actually got a makeup station set up in here. Okay, cool. So let me get you in. Yeah. I am your messenger for today. Okay. While you guys are both in isolation, uh, I will be um, kind of like your lesbian matchmaker who can go back and forth, Ooh. share messages, try to hype you guys up, Sweet. <laughs> um, try my best to do my best impersonation of whatever each of you want to say to the other. Okay. Um, uh, I'm also at your disposal. All right. So we'll let you get settled and, and kind of get started. Uh, we'll check back in with you a couple of times along the way. Cool. And then we do a quick interview with each of you on your own. I'll ask you a couple of questions and then we'll bring you together live. And from that point, you do your thing and you tell okay. us when you're done. Awesome. Sound good? Yes, All right, thank cool. you so much. Hi, I'm Victoria Vox. I am here to give my love and affection to a very special lady. Um, I have been performing for about five years now and days like today are really exciting to me because it doesn't even really feel like performing. It feels like I'm getting to come spend some time with a dear friend of mine um, doing the things that we like to do to each other anyway. And so I'm excited to get that on camera. It will be special for me to have it as well. Uh, the first time I met her and what kind of attracted me to her, I, I'm very introverted. Even though like when I'm at events, I'm very social butterfly. and. I was looking to kind of have a close friend and I just was like, hey, do you want to hang out? <laughs> and that's kind of how it happened. I remember one time I invited her to my house and we, there's this path 
uh, and we like walked a path for like almost an hour and a half and we had to walk back and we just talked and it was great. So I feel like it's really good to have someone that way to have close friends. So is there anything that I should share back with Lauren? Is there any kind of message? Um, yes. Are you ready to come? Oh, okay. I will. I'm going to do it like this <laughs> yeah, too. Yeah. Okay, good. That one, that one I will remember. When Let's it's a five minute right answer, back. that's when it sometimes gets to messed up. <laughs> All right, so I promise I'll, I'm going to do my best Victoria imitation, but only, only, actually only in body language, and I will deliver the line. Because she is far cooler than I'll ever be. But so I said, do you, is there anything that you want me to say to Lauren? And she put her hands on her hips like this, and kind of like, and she said, "What? Oh God, I can't remember." It's like she said, "Get ready to come." That's what she said. Perfect. There you go. That, that, that's a promise there. to me. So that's me hyping the both of you up. That's, Be still my that's how cool I am. What I enjoy most about being with another woman is that I don't feel like there's any necessity to put on. Being with another woman is special. It's intimate in a way that having a close girlfriend is supposed to feel. Um, and I think the best thing about being with girls is that we get to be intimate with each other. What are you most looking forward to doing with her today? When do you get that chance? <laughs> yeah. uh, what am I looking to do with her today is I would like to have sex with her. <laughs> I don't know if that was like on the list of stuff to do, but I personally, when I have a woman uh, in front of me. I personally love to enjoy the body of a woman. I think it's very beautiful and um, it's very sensual. And just to be able to enjoy every inch is usually like, I really, that's what I like to do. What would you like to say to her in return? Well, I feel like we both like fast in our birthdays. <laughs> so. You know what? That, I don't know if that's ever been done and maybe it should be. I kind of like that. It's the best thing yeah. to perform with that suit. And it's the easiest It's the easiest way to get things going, right? No extra layers. I, I support that idea because it will be a We Like Girls first. Good. And I'm always yeah. about that. Okay, so I will pitch that to her, see what she says, and let you know. Yeah, ask her if she brought her birthday suit. Okay, I'll, I will, there you go. That's the message. I will ask her that. I think that'll be fantastic. All right, Miss Victoria, I have an update for you. I did my best imitation. It, it, it did make her feet. Do a thing? Yeah, she started to do a sort of a strange a jig, wiggle. a little awesome. wiggle, yeah. yeah. So I think it was effective, even if it was like slightly <laughs> watered <jarring>. down. <laughs> yeah. Lauren suggested, what if you just both go in your birthday suits? Okay. Which I don't think we've ever done. Yeah. So it would be a first. Uh, that sounds awesome. And it would be less to remove afterwards. Yeah, and then I don't have to open my terrifying setback. <laughs> Perfect. Good. I love it. So if you're down with that, yeah. let's go for that. Um, um, the only thing we will do in advance is that little uh, sort of safe for work interview. So if you want to okay. just come as you are for that, okay, cool. then I'll have her do the same. And when you guys meet in person, there'll be nothing between you, especially close. I love it. It feels incredible to be chosen by Lauren. Uh, we've known each other since the beginning of my career. Man, there's not even a great word for it because I feel respected and loved by her always, but it kind of validates that we both know that we have a little special something for each other. And uh, to get that on camera, like I said before, it's just gonna be something that when I'm 90, I'm still gonna watch and be like, oh, Lauren, that's my girl. That's my girl, so it's really special and fun. <laughs> I think my reaction is I'm gonna be happy. I'll probably smile a little <laughs> and laugh and be excited as always. Um, but I feel like, I don't know, I just wanna hold her. <laughs> Excellent, well I think we could definitely allow that, enable that to happen, encourage that to happen. And we're gonna have a great time, trust me, once I get my hands on her. Just to let you know that Victoria is very down for the birthday suit option. <laughs> if for anything, because it means she doesn't have to open her terrifying setback. <laughs> so she appreciates your choice on multiple levels. <laughs> See, aim to please. Aim to please, there you go. She, you know, what do they say? Happy, happy wife, happy life. Well, happy set wife for today, happy life. <laughs> According to Lauren, Victoria and Lauren are really close friends off camera 
and they have worked together, but they've never been able to enjoy a one-on-one, -on -one, no holds barred experience until today. But that's why we're here, right? So I can't wait to see what they're gonna do to each other, with each other, um, exactly how they want to. I think it's long overdue. Let's all see Lauren and Victoria. So welcome to We Like Girls.